Yo, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel. I'm JR, and this is Motivation on Everything. Today, this video is going to be a little different. Um, I want to encourage people to put together a snatch and go bag. And what I mean by that is, it's going to be something like this. Um, this would be something you put together in case of an emergency. So you can just snatch and go all the things that you have that might be important to you. I would recommend that you put together stuff that will help you survive on the outside. This bag would also be considered a camping bag. So I'm going to go over each item that I have and share with you guys. And whatever I don't have time for, I'm going to move on to the next video. So stay tuned for that. So before we get started, um, I want to let you know I'm giving my own personal review. I'm not being sponsored by anybody and I'm not getting paid for this. So I'm letting you know what I think of these items that I've purchased for myself and you decide whether or not it will be a good fit for you. I will provide information on the item in the description, so check that out. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can receive notifications on new videos that will keep you motivated. Now let's get into it. First item I'm going to go over with you guys is called Sup Rock. It's right here. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what's inside. Okay, the product that I have here and we'll give a review on is Sup Rock. I ordered this on Amazon. Check the link down below in the description if this is something you think you may be interested in. They also have more details on the product and a demonstration video. At the end of my review, I will give my opinion on what I like and dislike about the product. So stick around for that. Here we have is a 24 in one multifunction tool. It includes shovel, axe, knife, saw, hook, corkscrew, whistle, igniter, hammer, and more. Let's go over a few of the functions and how to assemble. This part of the tool turns into a knife. The knife slides out, then you screw it to the handle. Now it's ready for use. This also has a bottle opener on it and can be used for the igniter. This piece right here is the igniter and when you unscrew it, it also turns into a whistle. Maybe it might come in handy when you're lost in the woods or something. Let's go ahead and demonstrate how it works. Take your knife, scrape the igniter till you get a spark. This will help start a fire. Wow, okay, that works. FYI, this is for outdoor use only. Let's unscrew the knife and move on to the axe. Screw on the attachment handle. You can adjust the length of the axe. Remove the protective cover and you're ready to chop some wood. You have a hammer feature on this axe as well. Unscrew the axe, then you can replace it with the shovel. The shovel has a saw feature, so you can saw things in half. Use the hexagon wrench to unscrew things. Take out screws with this part of the shovel. This part of the shovel will allow you to chop things up. You can dig a hole or cover up a hole. As I break down the tool, we come across our next feature, the screwdriver. The screwdriver is held by a magnet inside the handle. Shake the handle and the screwdriver will drop out. The handle has a socket to lock the screwdriver in place. One side is a screwdriver and the flip side is a flathead screwdriver. Okay, so my overall review, I think this product is a good thing to have in your snatch and go bag for the outdoors. It's very useful, but my only concern is when you're using the axe and trying to chop wood, the screw on handles start to loosen up when you're chopping the wood. I feel like the axe will spin off and cut me. 
that's my only concern and dislike with this product. Other than that, I still think it's worth buying if you're careful and not chopping some tough wood like I tried to do. Well, that's it for now. If you found anything that was useful in this video or you have any suggestions for me that you think I should add on to my bag, go ahead and drop a comment down below and let me know. I have much more to share with you guys, so stay tuned for the next video to see what else I have inside. Now let's end it off with saying, don't ever give up. Stay strong. Let's see what works. Until next time, stay motivated.